Let's start in child pose. So find your mat, bring your hips into your heels. Then bring your forehead to the mat. If you want to soften your shoulders, you can bring your arms by your side, sponsor facing up, relaxing your shoulders down, dropping them to the ground. If you like to, you can bring your arms forward, elbows down, and close your eyes. Allow yourself this moment to just breathe into this space right here, right now. And knowing that we have 60 minutes ahead where we're gonna be present with our breath, listening to our body, to our hearts. And you go to the people, we share uh, audible breaths. So exhale all the air out if you wanna join us. SH. Take a big belly inhale. Exhale, H, A, uh, let it go, let it fly. Nobody's watching you, nobody's hearing you. So just use that vibrational breath, H, M, H, A, anytime you like to explore that. It's an option, right? Notice your breath, notice your body. It's always different, so no expectations for today, right? If your arms are not forward, start to walk your arms forward. So, so much to the degree that your wrists and elbows are lifted from the mat. Stay where you are, Rosanna. Nice. Press down through your hips. Keep reaching forward through your fingertips so you find traction in your spine. Nice. And slowly start to come to a tabletop position bringing your hips on top of your wrists and your hips on top of your knees. We're gonna do some cat cows here. Inhale, head back to your mat. Drop your belly heavy, reach your tailbone towards the sky. Exhale, chin to your chest, round spine, belly up and in, cat spine. Inhale, head back to your mat. Drop your belly heavy, cow. Exhale, chin to your chest, round spine, belly up and in. Inhale, head back to now. Exhale, chin to chest. Right here, you can move it around. Do some circles with your head, with your hips. You can swing back, forward, right to left. Do some circles. Just free your, your body a little bit. Not much structure, just yourself, your breath. And in the next exhale, come to a tabletop position, tuck your toes, and lift your knees one inch above the mat, chin to your chest, round spine. Press down through your heels, knuckles of your palms, and fingertips, building some heat in your body. Inhale, exhale, H, A, ha. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, bring your hips up, your heels low for the first downward facing dog. And you can move it around right away. Put out your feet, mobilize your hips, shake your head. Do whatever feels good to you today. With no agenda, if you have like certain habits that you do the same thing every time you come to your mat, maybe. Try not to do it today. So hand shoulder width distance. Shoulders away from your ears. Press down through your knuckles. Inhale, bend both of your knees. Reach your hips up towards the sky. Exhale, keep your hips where they are and reach your heels down into the ground. Inhale, lift your right leg up and back. Exhale, bend your knee, knee to your right elbow, belly up and in. Inhale, lift your right leg, up and back. Exhale, knee to your left elbow. 
Inhale, lift your right leg up and back. Exhale, open your hips up. Right hip on top of your left. Move it around. Do some circles with your um, uncle, your knee. Inhale, square your hips. Exhale, step it through in between your hands. Drop your back knee down. Untuck your back toes. Press your left hand down and reach your right arm up. To find a twist. Reach your right arm towards the sky, towards the ceiling. Press down through your left knee, left top of your foot. Inhale. Exhale, drop your right hand down. Bring both of your hands on top of your knee. Interlace all 10 fingers and press your knee away from your chest. Press down through your left hip forward. Squeeze your left glute. Open your hips. Then slowly open your heart. If you want to move forward, bring your hands to your lower back. Head back, chin up. Squeeze your left hip forward. Drop your head heavy. Reach your heart up. Let's exit the pose. Bring both of your hands to the mat. Tuck your back toes. Lift your right leg up and back. Exhale, drop your right foot down. Let's do the other side. Inhale, lift your left leg up and back. Exhale, bend your knee, meet your left elbow. Shoulders on top of your wrist. Inhale, lift your left leg up and back. Exhale, knee to your right elbow. Look over to your right shoulder. Inhale, lift your left leg up and back. Exhale, knee to your nose. Inhale, lift your right leg up, left leg up and back. Exhale, open your hips up. Left hip on top of your right. Nice and move it around, feeling the left side of your body. Not trying to feel the same that you did in the right side because both sides are different. So treat them as they are, right? Inhale, square your hips, long straight leg. Corner flex your toes, nice. Exhale, step it through in between your hands. Nice, drop your back knee down, untuck your toes, right hand down. Inhale, lift or reach your left arm up towards the sky. Find a twist. Nice. Hips forward, chin to your left shoulder. Inhale, reach both of your hands away from each other. Exhale, left hand down from your foot. Nice. Inhale, place both of your hands in your left, on top of your left knee, interlace all 10 fingers. Nice. So you want to press down through your right top of your foot. Press your right hip forward. Squeeze your right glute. Nice. Now, press your knee away from your chest. And if you want to move forward, Lift your heart more up. Press, place your hands to your lower back. Fingertips are facing down. Head back to now. Bump your hips forward. Inhale through the nose. Exhale. Slowly exit the pose. Inhale. Lift your left, tuck your back toes. Lift your left leg up and back. Exhale. Drop your left foot down into the ground. Find downward facing dog again. And inhale, bend both of your knees, look forward. And exhale, walk or hop both of your feet forward. Find forward fold. Drop your body heavy, bend both of your knees. You can swing right to left, left to right. Interlace all 10 fingers behind your neck. I'll grab opposite elbows with opposite hands. Whatever feels good inside your body. It's all about what you guys. Inhale, half lift, reset your spine. Reach the crown of your head forward, hip bones back. Place your hands on your shins or thighs, never on your knees or protecting your knees. Exhale, forward fold. Let's do it once more time. Like one breath, one movement. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, reach your arms down, forward, and up. 
and find your extended mountain pose. Now close your eyes. You've been here so many times. You're always standing in both of your feet. So what makes this uh, yoga pose, it's the awareness you put inside your body. Allow yourself to feel the outer edges of your feet, maybe the ball of your feet, your heels, the inside edges of your feet. Pull up the muscles of your kneecaps. Tuck your tailbone, belly up and in. Now from the waist up, you grow tall, up towards the ceiling, towards the sky, like you're trying to touch something up there. And from the waist down, you're rooting down, like roots. Relax your shoulders down, squeeze your armpits towards each other, so pinkies are trying to touch each other. Inhale. Exhale, H, A. Flutter your eyes open. Inhale, look up, reach up, look back, reach back. Exhale, forward fold, drop your body heavy. Let's do it one more time. Inhale, reach your arms down, forward and up. Come all the way up, all the way back. Exhale, forward fold, let it go. Now you can take it by your own one breath, one movement. Mountain pose, extended mountain pose. You can close your eyes. You've been there before a lot of times. So make this more about what you're feeling than what you see, right? When we close our eyes, we allow ourselves to go deeper, to see things that we can't see with our eyes. If you finish mountain pose, let's meet in a forward fold. Drop your body heavy. Nice. Bend both of your knees. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, forward fold. Now place both of your hands in the mat. Step back. And let's meet an upper push-up one. So guys, shoulders on top of your wrist. Hips in line with your shoulders. Suck your tailbone belly up and in. Heels on top of the ball of your feet. We're gonna build a flow. It's a connecting tissue of the hour. Belly up and in. Inhale, push your mind away. Exhale, bend your elbows down and in halfway. Inhale, scoop up your chest. Forward and up. Untuck your toes. Suspend your upper body in between your hands. Exhale. Downward facing dog. Hips up, heels low. Nice. Inhale, lift your right leg up and back. Exhale, stick your throat in between your hands. Rotate your back heel down and rise up. Find your warrior one. Now press down through the outer edge of your left foot. So your back leg is really straight, really strong. Right thigh stay parallel to the floor, knee on top of your ankle. Now from the waist up, it's like a mountain pose. We're trying to square the hips towards the front edge of the mat. Keep reaching up through your fingertips. Choose how, do you, how you want them. You want them way apart or squeeze them together. Intention in your movements. Inhale, sit a little bit lower. Exhale, stay where you are. Inhale. Exhale, feel open, warrior two. Right arm forward, left arm back. Shin to your right shoulder. Now, you want to open your hips here. Your front leg stays where, they, where it is. Now, tuck your tailbone under. Squeeze your inner thighs towards each other, energetically talking. Rosa, bend your right knee a little bit more. Inhale. Exhale, curl your hands down. Step back and travel through the flow we built before. Good, good Mia. Inhale, lift your left leg up and back. Exhale, super three in between your hands. Rotate your back heel down and rise up. Find warrior one. Beautiful. Press down through your outer edge of your right foot. 
Bend your left knee until your left thigh is parallel to the floor. Belly up and in, and keep reaching up through your fingertips. Watch you, while you keep your left lunge low. Keep breathing through the nose, rinse your shoulders down. Inhale, sit a little bit lower. Good job. Exhale, peel open, warrior two, left arm forward, right arm back. You can wider your stand. And try to square your hips to the side edges of your mat or the side walls of your room, your living room, right? Extend both of your hands away from each other. Tuck your tailbone belly up and in. Now you wanna open your heart through your fingertips. This is the closest pathway energetically talking to our heart with our magic resides. So extend those just finger, fingertips away from each other. Inhale, sit a little bit lower. Exhale, curl your hands down, step back and travel through your flow. And guys, this time you can take it by your own one breath, one movement. Warrior one, warrior two. I want to encourage you to close your eyes today. Maybe imagine uh, all these people around you, practicing, practicing along you, creating this beautiful energy. Just know that you have the power to have the best practice of your life right here, right now. You are the one who make it happen. Now you inhale, you move. You exhale, you move again. Synchronizing movement with breath, breath with movement. Mia, sit a little bit lower. Nice girl. Exhale, you move again. Inhale, you move. Exhale, you move again. If you finish warrior one, warrior two, let's meet in downward facing dog. Very strong, hold this space for each other. Inhale, lift your right leg up and back. Exhale, step it through in between your hands. Keep your back heel up and find power lunge. Nice. So left, right heel on top of your right ball of your foot. Your biceps are by your ears. And the back side of your knees try to touch up the sky. Left thigh parallel to the floor, right thigh parallel to the floor. Inhale. Exhale, open. Warrior two, drop your back heel down. Press down through your heels, tuck your tailbone, open your heart. Chin to your left shoulder, and we're gonna go to reverse warrior. Flip your left, your right palm up, put your right fingertips forward, up and back. Find a side bend. Now you can bring your right hand, your left hand to your shin or your thigh. Or, can, or you can write your back arm behind your back, pressing down through your front thigh. Inhale. Sit a little bit lower. Exhale, curl your hands down, step back, travel through your flow. Let's do the other side. Inhale, lift your left leg up and back. Exhale, step it through in between your hands. Keep your back heel up and rise up. Find your power lunge, sorry, your crescent lunge. So right heel on top of the ball of your foot, left thigh parallel to the floor, belly up and in. Hey Jody. Keep reaching up through your fingertips towards the sky. Inhale, we're gonna move forward to warrior two. Exhale, drop your back heel down. Feel open, find warrior two, left arm forward, right arm back. 
which you both of your hands away from each other. Tuck your tailbone, strong legs. Now chin to your left shoulder, flip your left palm up, reach your left fingertips forward, up and back. And find peaceful warrior, reverse warrior. You can wrap your back arm behind your back, pressing in through your palm through the front thigh. Nice. Look towards the ceiling, inhale, feel the left side opening, stretching. Exhale, curl your hands down, step back, and travel through your flow. And guys, this time you can take it by your own. One breath, one movement. High lunge, warrior two, reverse warrior. Maybe close your eyes. Maybe focus more in what's happening inside you while you're moving, while you're breathing. Maybe you can get to hear the heartbeat inside your chest. And if that's not your experience, if you're maybe thinking, oh, I want to end a meeting, she's now going to realize and leaving, maybe power through that feeling and keep breathing, keep moving without judging. If you want to go to child pose, you're welcome to be in child pose. If you finish the flow, high lunge, warrior two, reverse warrior, right leg and left side. Let's meet in downward facing dog. John, exhale all the air out, S-H, you got this. Take a big belly, inhale. Exhale, H-A, Nice. Inhale, bend both of your knees, look forward and walk or hop both of your feet forward, find forward fold, drop your body heavy. Nice. Make sure your feet are hips with distance and swing right to left, left to right. Uh, whatever feels good, maybe uh, bring your bullet to your thighs. Inhale, half lift, reset your spine. Exhale, forward fold, drop your body heavy. Inhale, arms up, hips low, find chair pose. Nice. And choose in which kind of chair do you want to sit today? You want to sit in the sofa in the living room or in a bench or you want to be in a stool, maybe a little bit higher. Whatever it is, Stay in a place or maybe challenging a little bit yourself. Belly up and in. Keep reaching forward and up to your fingertips. Sit a little bit lower. Rinse your shoulders down. Breathe. Feel like it's honey traveling through your body right here and right now. Good job, Charlie. Inhale. Sit a little bit lower. Chest forward and up. Exhale. Forward fall. Good job, Rosanna. Keep breathing. Let it go. Ah, you can flutter your lips. And let's do it one more time. Inhale, arms up, hips low, chair pose. Weight back into your heels, belly up, and inches forward and up. You know the alignment of the pose. Now try to be the pose. Try to just Stay in this very moment with your breath and hold that space. Feel the power inside your breath, your muscles. Inhale, sit a little bit lower, keep reaching up towards the sky. Good job, Mia. Exhale, forward fall, drop your body heavy, let it go. Nice. Inhale, arms up, hips low, third chair pose. Nice. Arms, biceps by your ears, rinse your shoulders down, keep reaching up through your fingertips. And guys, if you at this moment, you're like, I can't just know that yoga is here to remind you those thoughts 
are just thoughts. Those are not who you are. You can sit a little bit lower. You can keep reaching up towards the sky. Like the best version of, of yourself is up there. Inhale. Exhale. Stay where you are. Inhale. Stand up. Look up. Reach up. Look back. Reach back. Exhale. Forward fall. Good job, guys. You can interlace all 10 fingers behind your back and then reach your fist forward. Drop your head heavier. Nice. You give yourself a nice stretch to your shoulders, shoulder blades. Inhale. Exhale. Drop your hands down. Inhale. Half lift. Reset your spine. Exhale. Forward fold. Place both of your hands in the mat. Step back and travel through your flow. Good, sweet flow, Jody. Nice. Inhale, lift your right leg up and back. Exhale, step it through in between your hands. Drop your back heel down, reach your arms back and up and find power lunge. Yes, you're doing a 45 degree angle from the crown of your head towards your back heel. Inhale, interlace all 10 fingers behind your back. Exhale, trying to punch the back wall. Nice. Press your palms together. Inhale. Exhale, extend both of your arms forward. Extended power lunge. Belly up and in. Inhale. Rise up, warrior one. Exhale, peel open, warrior two, right arm forward, left arm back. Open your hips up. Extend both of your fingertips, set of fingertips away from each other and tilt your upper body down. Find side angle. Right arm down, left arm up. You can place your right uh, forearm on your right leg or just bring your right hand right by your right foot. Extend both of your legs hands away from each other. Left shoulder on top of your right. Inhale, chin to your left shoulder. Exhale, send your left arm forward, left bicep by your ear. Nice. Extend the side angle. Roll open, try to bring your heart towards the ceiling. Inhale. Exhale, send your right arm forward and up. Both biceps by your ears, core strengthen your belly up and in. Keep pressing down through your heels. Inhale. Breathe, exhale, revolve the side angle, drop your left hand down, walk your back foot a little before, reach your right arm up towards the sky. Now try to bring your right shoulder on top of your left. Bring your left shoulder more forward, Charlie. Yes, nice. Chin to your right shoulder, inhale. Exhale, drop your right hand down inside your right foot. And let's move forward to ankle bind. Interlace all 10 fingers around your ankle. Try to bring your upper body underneath your right thigh. Drop your head heavy. If you like to drop your back knee down, you can do it. Or you can keep pressing down through your outer edge of your back foot. Inhale. Exhale, we're gonna move forward to lizard. So tuck your back toes. You can move forward and back, forward and back when you're back. Drop your back knee down. Walk your right foot a little bit more towards the right edge of your mat. And you can stay on your hands, so hands underneath your shoulders, or you can bring your forearms to the ground if that's available for you. If you can maybe bring your chest. Exhale all the air out, SH. Big belly, inhale. Exhale, HA. Let's start to walk your hands. Tuck your back toes. Bring your right foot back, step back, and travel through your flow. Upper dog, inhale. Exhale, downward facing dog. Hips up, heels low. Let's do the other side. Inhale, lift your left leg up and back. 
exhale, step it through in between your hands. Rotate your back heel down and reach your arms back and up. Palms are facing down. Press down through the outer edge of your back foot. Power lunge. Inhale, interlace all ten fingers behind your back. Exhale, trying to bow up wall with your fist. Inhale. Exhale, extending both of your arms forward, both biceps by your ears. Extended power lunge. Belly up and in. Inhale, rise up, warrior one. Exhale, peel open, warrior two. Left or forward, right or back. Chin to your left shoulder. Inhale, reach both of your hands away from each other. Opening the heart. Exhale, tilt your upper body down. Side angle, left arm down, right arm up. You can bring your left forearm to your left thigh. If you want to move forward, left hand down into the ground. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, extend your right arm forward. Extend the side angle. Tuck your tailbone, belly up and in. Shine your heart towards the sky. Inhale. Left your, lift your left arm up. Pull the biceps by your ears. Look up towards the sky, roll open. Core strengthener. Inhale. Let's revolve the side angle. Drop your right arm down. Walk your back foot a little bit forward. And reach your left arm up towards the sky. Find a twist. Try to bring your left shoulder on top of your right. Inhale. Exhale, drop your left hand inside your left foot. Walk your left foot a little bit towards the top left edge of your mat. Tuck your back toes. Rock forward and back, forward and back. Drop your back foot down, untuck your toes. And if you like, you can stay here. You can bring your forearms to your mat. If you can move forward, you can bring your chest to the mat, whatever feels good to you right now. Chain to your chest. Let's exit the pose, bring your hands underneath your shoulders, tuck your back toes, walk your left foot towards uh, the inside of your mat, so left heel on uh, underneath your left knee. And we forgot ankle bind, so we're gonna do it now. Drop your right uh, heel down, interlace all 10 fingers around your ankle, chin to your chest, drop your head heavy. <sighs> Inhale. Exhale, bring both of your hands to the mat. Step your left foot back and travel through your flow. Inhale, push your mat away. Exhale, bend your elbows on it. In. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Exhale, all the air out. S H. Take a big belly, inhale. Exhale, H A. Ha. Let it go. Inhale, walk or hop both of your feet forward. Five forward fold. Bring both of your feet together. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, forward fall. <sighs> Inhale, arms up, hips slow, thunderbolt. Weight back into your heels, squeeze your inner knees, inner ankles, inner thighs. Arms forward and up. Inhale. Bring both of your hands to center, heart. Exhale, twist your upper body to your right. Left elbow to your right knee. Keep your uh, hands on your heart so you're twist evenly. We're doing a straight line from your right elbow to your left elbow. Inhale. Exhale, come back to center. Inhale. Stand up. 
Look up, reach up, look back, reach back. Exhale, come back to center. Identify your right arm and swing right arm underneath your left. Press elbows, wrist, palms press. Raise your shoulders down. This is an eagle wrap. Now, inhale, sit down, sit back. Weight into your left foot. Pick up your right thigh up and over your left thigh. Cross your legs, point your right toes behind your left calf. Sit a little bit lower. The chest forward and up. And now listen carefully. We're gonna unravel the legs and we're gonna bring the right leg back and up. If you wanna find warrior tree, you can extend your arms forward. Inhale. We fall over, come back. Exhale, bring your right foot to meet your left foot and drop your body heavy. Find forward fold. Hmm. Inhale. Arms up, hips low. Thunderbolt. We're going to do the other side. Weight back into your heels. Squeeze your inner ankles, inner thighs. Press your palms together. Inhale, hands to center, heart. Exhale, twist your left. Right elbow to the inside of your left knee. Inhale. Exhale, come back to center. Inhale, stand up. Look up, reach up. Look back, reach back. Exhale, come back to center. Left arm underneath your right. Cross elbows, wrist, palms press. Raise your shoulders down. Now inhale, sit down, sit back. Now weight in your other foot, pick up your left thigh up and over your right. Cross your legs, point your left toe, sit a little bit lower. Belly up and in, chest forward and up. Look to one point of focus in front of you. With a lot of intention, inhale. Listen carefully, press down through your right foot. Start to unravel your legs. Bring your left leg back and up. Do a straight line. If you want to extend your left arms, your arms forward, warrior three. Point and flex your left toes. Inhale. Excellent. Bring your left foot to touch your right foot. Find forward four. Huh. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, forward fold. Place both of your hands in the mat. Step back, travel through your flow. Nice. Exhale all the air out. S H. Take a big belly inhale. Exhale H A. Let it go. Nice. Inhale. Lift your right leg up and back. Bend your right knee and sweep it through. Find half pigeon on the right side of your body. Right knee wetter than your right hip. Square your hips towards the front edge of your mat. Flex your right toes to protect your right knee. You're doing a straight line with your left leg. So from your hip down into your heel, your left heel is straight, is in line. Now you can stand to start to walk your hands into the ground, maybe your forearms, maybe your forehead touches the mat. Maybe your chest can feel the ground. 
and allow your body to be heavy, to soften, and breathe through maybe uh, that discomfort. Release anything you have in your hips through your breath. We're gonna to start to exit the pose with control. Start to walk your hands underneath your shoulders. Tuck your back toes, step back. You can travel through your flow. You can go right away to downward facing dog or three-legged downward facing dog, whatever feels good to you. And then we're gonna do the other side. Inhale, lift your left leg up and back. Bend your left knee and step it through, sweep it through. And bring your left knee wider than your left hip. Square your, your hips towards the front edge of your mat. Uh, and, and tuck your back toes. Slowly with control. Start to walk your upper body down. Close your eyes. And focus on your breath. Allowing the ground to hold you. Start to walk your upper body up slowly. Bring your hands underneath your shoulders, tuck your back toes, step back, travel through the flow. Or just go right away to downward facing dog, tree legged, downward facing dog, whatever feels good inside your body. And once you get to downward facing dog, maybe close your eyes and feel your body out. What are the difference between this downward facing dog and the first downward facing dog of the hour? Notice if anything has changed inside your body, inside your mind, your heart, any sensation, emotion has left or has come. And just be aware of that, observe that. Inhale, come to upper push-up plank. Exhale, downward facing dog, hips up, heels low. Inhale, upper push-up plank. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, come to upper push-up plank. Stay where you are, shoulders on top of your wrist, hips in line with your shoulders, nice. Inhale, push your mat away. Exhale, bend your elbows down and in slowly until your body drops heavy into the ground. And now keep your hands underneath your shoulders, on top your toes. Knees, um, elbows are up, like grasshopper legs. Squeeze your elbows behind your back. Cool. Press down through the top of your feet. Inhale. Scoop up your chest forward and up. Head back to now. Look up towards the sky. Press down through the top of your feet so your knees are lifted. Press down through your hips. Maybe lift your, your hands up. Use the strength of the spine, the muscles of your back. Nice. Exhale. Relax your body down. Left ear to the mouth. Look to your right arms by your sides. Drop your body head. Let it go. Now bring your chin to the mat, reach your arms forward for superhuman human pose. Sweep up your legs, inhale, lift everything up from the mat, press down through your hips, squeeze your glutes. Nice, head back, chin up, look up, inhale, lift your thighs up, lift your upper body up. Exhale, drop your body heavy, good job. Right ear to the mat, look to your left side of the, of the room and breathe. Just 
Allow yourself to be here in the stillness for 20 seconds. Chin to the mat, bend both of your knees, grab your feet from the outside edges. Try to keep your knees together as long as you can. Mia from the outside edges, so from the pinky side, nice. Inhale, kick your feet into your hands, head back, chin up, look up, Ava, look up towards the sky, nice. You are trying to find your toes with your side. Roll into the soft part of your belly, inhale, kick. Soften your breath, breathe through the nose, kick, kick, drop your body heavy, let it go with control. Nice. We're gonna move forward to camel pose. Bring your hands underneath your shoulders. Please come to standing on your knees and bring your knees hips with distance. Bring your hands to your lower back, fingertips are facing down. Squeeze your elbows towards each other now head back, chin up, you are in the pose, right there. If you want to move forward because your body is allowing you today to move forward, maybe drop your body, your upper, your head heavier and try to find the back wall. If you can see the back wall, maybe try to find the floor, maybe grab your heels, but only if you can. You can say just uh, dropping your head back and the chin up and that's it. You're in the pose already. Listen to your body. Breathe through the nose and slowly start to exit the pose. Place your hands in your lower back. And then bring your hips to your heels. Bring your hands to your center heart. Maybe close your eyes. And allow yourself to feel the heart beat inside your chest. Maybe be grateful for everything you have. For being able to be here sharing. Being able to have a community and connect from the heart. You can dedicate your practice as well. Flutter your eyes open. Extend both of your legs forward. So we're gonna do a seated forward fold. Bring uh, the fleshy parts of your hips out. Extend both of your legs forward. Reach your arms down forward and up towards the sky. Inhale. Exhale, hinge your hips. Grab your feet. You can drop your head heavy, chin to your chest, or you can puff your chest forward. Bringing your shoulders down and back. Bring your thighs, your belly to your thighs. Slowly start to uncurl your spine with control. Bend your knee. Scooch your hips forward. Lift your shins up until they are parallel to the floor. Press your palms together in center. Extend your elbows. Inhale. Exhale. Twist your upper body to your right. Inhale. Come back to center. Exhale. Twist your left. Inhale. Center. Exhale. Twist right. Inhale. Center. Exhale, twist left. Inhale, center. Exhale, twist. Inhale, center. Exhale, twist. Now open your arms up. Inhale, bring your knees to your chest. Exhale, extend lower and hover. Inhale, knees to chest. Exhale, extend lower and hover. Inhale, knees to chest. Exhale, extend lower and hover. Biceps by your ears. So some sit across with your legs for five, four, Three, two, one. Bicycle crunches, right elbow to your left knee, left elbow to your right knee for five, four, three, two, one. Drop your body heavy, 
Bring your knees in towards your chest. Give yourself a big hug. Grab opposite elbows with opposite hands swing right to left, left to right. Hmm. Let's move forward to butterfly pose. Bring both of the sole of your feet together. Interlace all 10 fingers on the other edge of your, or your feet. Now bring your knees towards the front edge of your mat. And open your hips up, shoulders down. And if you want to move to happy baby, bring your ankles outside of your knees, your knees wider than your hips. You can swing right to left, left to right. Maybe if you like to extend your left leg, extend your right leg, maybe both. It's up to you, whatever your body's up today. And slowly you can go to Shavasana. Or we're gonna do a shoulder stand pal and then man pose. So lift your legs up to do a straight line from your navel to your toes. Bring your hands to your lower back. Squeeze your elbows towards each other. Belly up and in. Now if you want to move forward to plow, start to bring your feet towards the floor above the crown of your head. Tuck your toes, keep your legs straight. If you want and you can move forward, bend both of your knees, bring your knees right by your ears for that man pose. And breathe. Once you're ready, start to and crawl your spine slowly. And find Shavasana. Relax your toes. Your feet, your shins drop heavy into your calves. Feel your hips heavy into the ground. Fingers, hands are heavy. Relax your shoulders. Your face. Your head. Guys, thank you so, so much for being here. Um, it was great to get to spend these 55 minutes with you. I'm going to finish with a quote. And then I'm going to ring the singing ball. I'm going to take you out of Shivasana. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, we are yoga to the people. We ask for $12 donation. If you are in a place where you can donate, just know that is a gift to keep this yoga alive and keep this community alive. Thank you, thank you, thank you for that. Um, I'm going to read the quote. Learn to simultaneously be grateful and patient for the things you have and the things you desire. Rushing the process is the best way to resist the blessings that are making their way to you. Flow with this current phase of your life. Embrace the present and honor where you are at this very moment in the most unexpected ways. At the most unexpected times, you'll receive the very things you prayed for. Exhale all the air out. This H. Big belly inhale. 
Exhale, H-A-L. 